Hello, Paul is the best for UK here and welcome to today's Game of Day video. Now today's game is August for the uh, Sega SG-1000 ORGUSS. Title screen doesn't stay on very long does it? So uh, yep, let's uh, start the game. If I can. Now as you can see this is August and you are flying like this robot device. Have some of that. Oh you fuck. So the game's got primitive book. Oh you can change it to a spaceship as well. The game's got primitive uh, parallax scrolling. That's a side scroller. And you have the graphics up the park, you've got your trees and you've got your mountains, you've got your horizon, you've got your, your clouds in the sky. So you, anytime you can trans you can change from that robot thing into this little thing. So yeah, the, 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 uh, this one goes slower than the other one, so it might be useful like, for like slower encounters of the baddies and that one might be useful for like faster encounters of the baddies. So just looks like basic sound effects, nothing too fancy. But, oh you fuck, I'm going to change it to the other one, see if that helps with more accurate precision shooting. Oh so, yeah, get the baddies here. So yeah, these games are pretty primitive, but bear in mind, the, if you was like playing them at the time, you, this is what you would have come to expect in a lot of games, to be honest, because that was what was known back in them days. And yet, this is quite impressive for the day. You only can shoot one bullet at a time. You can't shoot another bullet until your last bullet has gone out the screen or hit the baddie. So that's one disadvantage of the game. Can you on the little one? I'm not sure. Let's change it to little one. Now it's the same story, one bullet at a time. So just remember, bear that in mind when you're shooting the baddies. Only one at a time. Okay, we're going over the sea here. Have some of that. So as you progress through the level, you score automatically. Oh, you booner. Game over. Let's give this another shot, shall we? So you get a nice little intro tune. Right. Okay, let's uh, get these buddies here. Have some of that. It can be quite hard to get the buddies at times because they're, they're like they're good at avoiding your bullets. Have some of that. But it's quite original in the idea that you can change from different from this robot guy to this little spaceship at any time. That would have been quite energy back in these days when this game was released. Have some of that. Okay, let's get these baddies here. Oh shit. He's avoiding me. Oh, he nearly got me with his bullet then. Okay, let's try and get these guys here. Yep, so I'll try and get these ones. Have some of these. Oh shit. You can shoot their bullets actually. It's really good aim but you can actually shoot their bullets as well. So yeah, keep going. Check for this guy here. I'm missing quite a lot of them, aren't I? Okay, over the sea now. Whoa, 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 that was close. Oh, you fuck. At least you get to start from where you left off. That's a good thing about the game. I dislike it a bit when you have to start from the beginning every time you lose a life. That just gets frustrating. Make sure there's no baddies around you when you want to change to the other guy because it's, it gives them a chance to get you. Oh shit. Oh you fuck. Last life. Can I make it to round two? I doubt it. It's a long level isn't it? Oh that was close. 
Sometimes rather than shoot them, it can be sometimes better to avoid them. Okay, we're going over some patchwork now. Like a checkerboard, isn't it? It's nice it's got variety in the scenery. It's a long level, isn't it? Should just round one. Okay. Oh no! I was probably right near the end as well. So that was August on the uh, the uh, Sega SG1000. I'm going to give this one eight out of ten. Seems quite fun actually. So uh, thank you for watching. Bye.